Oh my god. You can kick people, bro. Stop. Bro, stop. You can be mean. What the fuck? That's so funny. Oh my god. Slide into it. Oh my god. <laughs> What up everybody, it's Adriana and welcome back to another DBD Mobile video. So the new update has arrived and we got a new survivor, a new killer, new animations and a little bit kind of new graphics. So that's what this video is going to be about. I mainly want to focus on Yoon and her perks. Although her perks aren't the greatest, I still wanted to do a round with just her three teachable perks to see how useful they were in a regular game. Then I did a round just with regular perks that I would usually put on. But let's go through Yoon's three teachable perks. So first we have Fast Track. So essentially this is a gen rush perk where you collect tokens for each survivor that is hooked. Here it says one token per survivor hooked. I think this is the lowest level, so the yellow level. But I think for the purple level, it's a maximum of three tokens per hook. And of course, the more tokens that you have, the more progress will be added to your generator when you decide to use the great skill check. So it's kind of up to you when you want to use this skill check, but all of your tokens will be consumed at that time that you hit the great skill check. I'll insert a clip here to show how much progress 15 tokens got me in a match. We got from uh, 15, 15 tokens. That was... Bro, that was actually pretty significant. Holy shit. 15 stacks did work. That's like a brand new part, basically. So yeah, you actually get a lot of progress and I think it's 15% at 15 tokens. So pretty good. Now granted, you do have to hit the great skill check and sometimes that's hard. So if you have this perk at the highest level, maximally you can have 27 tokens. So that's 27% progress on your generator which is more than a brand new part. So I imagine you can make a pretty nasty gen rush build with, for example, prove thyself fast track, I don't know, maybe resilience and a brand new part. You could get a gen done really, really fast. Next, we have smash hit. I personally think this is Yoon's best teachable perk. I really like the fact that you get four seconds of 150% your normal running speed. I find that very useful. But of course, you need to stun the killer in order to activate the perk, and sometimes that just doesn't always happen. And especially with the new palette bug that's on mobile, it's even harder to use. But when you do get the chance to use it, it's actually very, very useful, and it creates a lot of distance between you and the killer. So you can easily make it to a new tile or a new palette and extend the chase. Or you could just completely lose the killer. So yeah, Smash It gets 5 out of 5 bananas from me. Lastly, we have self-preservation. I honestly don't have too much to say about this one. I don't think it's necessarily good or bad. It's kind of like a baby iron will or lucky break. So as it says, it hides your scratch marks, pulls of blood, and grunts of pain just for 6 seconds. And it's only when another survivor within 60 meters of you gets hit by a basic attack by the killer. To be fair, 6 seconds can be significant in certain situations, but I would honestly rather just use 2 perk slots for Lucky Break and Iron Will. Iron Will hides Grants of Pain for the full duration that you're injured, and recently Lucky Break got the buff, which makes it last for I believe 120 seconds at the lowest tier. So yeah, not the best, not the worst, it's just kind of there. And yeah, those are Yoon's three teachable perks. Maybe that will help you decide on whether or not you want to invest in her. I personally think she's a great investment and she looks super fine. But anyways, the next biggest thing in the update was the animation changes to how these survivors walk, run, crouch, etc, etc. But I think the best way to show you that would just be through a match. So I'm going to shut up now and show you one of the rounds I did on the release day of the update. And this was just one of my favorite rounds. It's kind of random, but it does show the new animations and the new generator graphics. So I did like this round. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. All right. All right. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, what we're doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? These animations. Oh my god. Go stupid. Oh my god. This is so fucking hilarious. Oh my god. 
think it's Trickster. Yep, it is. Okay. I'm gonna pretend that didn't happen. Uh oh. Oh, what the hell? What the hell did you see that? Oh my god. What? What? What is he doing? What is he doing? What is he doing? Um I'm so confused what just happened. I'm gonna break these bones because uh, I need some comfort after that. Jesus Christ, what was that? Oh my god. And they changed the lighting of the generators. Like, I don't know if you noticed, but it like, looks more sparkly? Like, I don't know. It just looks so good and heavenly. I don't know. I really like it. I really like that. I really like that change. Oh. He found me. Well, technically I found him, but... He's figuring it out. He's figuring it out. get on this oh oh can I get it oh my god I'm so <laughs> I'm so sorry oh my god that was uh that was kind of toxic I'm not gonna lie but it's I it's I oh my god get 360 I feel so bad for this man I really do You are abusing the bug, but it's okay, I don't blame you. Oh my god. Me and the Sneha, we're just fighting for this chase. <laughs> okay. Oh my god, these scratch marks, bro. It's free fixated, bro. Oh, what? How did... Oh my god, how did we get all the gens done already? Like, literally, we've been here for, like, less than five minutes. I'm not kidding you. Oh my god. Son of a bitch. You... Oh my god, I got stuck! I got stuck! Oh my god. Feels bad. That's okay. I'll let him get it down. He didn't get it down the whole time. This poor m Oh my god. Two flashlights and they <laughs> neither of them got it. <laughs> this is so sad. Yo, BT? BT? Oh my god, this door isn't done. That's so funny. Let's go, let's go. This man wants me. I don't blame him. Oh my god. What? Is the door done? Go, go, go. Open the door. Open the door. Yo, run, my dude. This poor trickster. Like, like, look at this. I mean, this is the state of DVD right now. <laughs> oh 
we're just bullying. Let's leave. Let's leave. Oh my god. Oh my god. The dead heart. I. I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna leave. Oh my god. I feel so bad. <laughs> Anyways, that's gonna be it for this video. But thank you guys so much for watching. As always, I really appreciate it. I guess you could kind of call this the end of an era of DBD Mobile with the new animations. I'm definitely gonna miss the tappy feet and the old animations for sure. I just really like them a lot better how they were before. They felt way more natural. They looked a lot better in my opinion. And I mean, the tappy feet were just so hilarious. They made me laugh every single time I play DBD. So yeah, rip the old animations. You will be missed. And anyways, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!